I'm currently in a permanent role, but a lot of my friends are contracting and tell me that it's much more rewarding. I don't know whether to risk leaving my permanent job for a contract role. Contracting, for the first time, can be a daunting experience, but with the correct knowledge and guidance, it can provide a flexible solution to those looking for a shorter term employment. So why do companies employ contractors? Some companies use contractors to cover periods of absence of permanent staff, for example, such as maternity leave. Or it could be to obtain assistance with specific projects or during particularly busy times. And with some companies, it could even be to gain insight to a candidate's skills and experience prior to offering them a permanent role. And what benefits are there to contracting? There are many benefits, including having increased flexibility, you decide when and where you would like to work, and in order to suit your own personal circumstances. You also have the opportunity to earn more money. Contractors are often paid significantly more than permanent employees in the same field. And there is further opportunity to further develop skills by working in multiple contract positions in a relatively short space of time. What else do I need to consider before leaving my permanent role? Contractors are normally expected to organise their own training at their own expense. Contracting can sometimes mean commuting long distances or relocating for periods of time, but you are able to offset the costs as a business expense. And there can also be unplanned breaks in between assignments with no income. If you are thinking of leaving a permanent job for a contract role, you will need to assess your own personal circumstances when making a decision. Thanks for that. I'll have a good think about what you've said before I make up my mind.